contender target if I was looking for a wide receiver piece to really give me a push would be Jacksonville Jaguars new wide receiver Calvin Ridley who has a clear case of what have you done for me lately syndrome by the community in my opinion due to him not playing since October 24th of 2021 but you might have to dust off the rust a little bit but you don't forget skill who showed us plenty of that in Atlanta in 2021. He only played in five games, but he averaged 14.2 points per game. He also averaged 10.4 targets, and he was number seven in target share. The big season was in 2020. He averaged 18.8 fantasy points per game, which was number four. He had 143 targets, 90 receptions, 1,374 receiving yards, which was the fourth most, nine touchdowns. He had very fantasy appealing usage. He was number one that season in air yards, number one in deep targets, number two in red zone targets. Previously regarded as one of the best fantasy football assets for the wide receiver position, and he finds himself in a very good situation. Especially with Trevor Lawrence, who we saw a huge difference in from year two in comparison to his rookie season. He played 17 games in both but he upped his passing yards, his completion percentage. He turned over the ball a lot less. He doubled his passing touchdowns. In 2022, he was top 10 in passing yards, passing touchdowns. The opportunity is nice there. He was top 10 as well in passing attempts, deep ball attempts, and red zone attempts. Christian Kirk and Zay Jones had really nice seasons. Kirk had 133 targets, Zay Jones 121. And no disrespect to those guys, but for me... Calvin Ridley is a different wide receiver than both of those guys. Straight NFL stats, fantasy stats, he's done what neither of those guys have done before. So checking many boxes, I mean, former first-round draft pick, a massive season under his belt, a history of earning targets, an offense that has been looking better and better with a quarterback who took a major leap in year two. If we're talking comeback season, it's Calvin Ridley, and it's going to happen in 2023. So maybe close to your rookie draft, maybe on your rookie draft day, I might see what an early second-round pick can do to get Calvin Ridley, especially if I feel like, hey, I'm, I'm one wide receiver piece away from really giving me an edge for a championship. Go buy Calvin Ridley.